Just like Little Richard. Did I ever tell you the time I met Little Richard in an elevator in Los Angeles? No? Did I tell you that story? Tell us, tell us. I was in an elevator in Los Angeles. It's a good story. Descending, and uh, we stopped at a, on a floor, and the doors opened, and uh, in walked Little Richard. And he stood next to me, and he turned his back to the wall and face the doors as they close, like most people do when you enter an elevator. And the doors closed, sorry Jeremy, and the doors closed and uh, we started descending in the elevator. It was me and a friend of mine, little Richard, and his handler. Who's the friend? Uh, his name was Steve. Steve. He was uh, and Steve Duran, in fact. And so anyway, you know, we're going down in the elevator with little Richard. He's dressed completely, immaculately to the nines. You know, he he looked over, his skin had like like an eight inch of foundation on it, and full makeup, and he was sparkling in a sparkly jacket. He was on his way out, obviously. It was his birthday, as it turns out. And, uh, yeah, what are you going to do? You can't just not acknowledge that. So I said, excuse me, but you're a little richer, you know. And can I, can I shake your hand? He said, yeah, I can shake my hand. I want to I touch you. Everybody! I want to touch everybody! And he <coughs> proceeded to touch everybody <coughs> in the elevator. But it was like, one of those moments, like, man, you are a little richer. Like, all the time. And I was so impressed. And you know, the doors opened up in the lobby, and he walked out, and he went to his birthday party in a uh, little Richard fashion. And me and my friend looked at each other, and we said, I can't believe that just happened. And uh, 
we got on with our boring lives. And pretty much that was the highlight of my life. All the